the barn here. That's 66 heading uh, east. And this is this historical building, it says out here. It's totally collapsed. It looks like it was an old gas station. Um, anyway, the two times I drove by, I wanted to see what was going on here, and now I'm finally gonna do it. It's got something written on the uh, thing up here. This looks like it's ready to just collapse on me. Look at this. Old, old, old. Looks like there's the fireplace. The roof's gone. Okay, let me read about it, what it says. Okay, what the sign said is that this once was a gas station they believe built in the early teens. And uh, at one time, supposedly the owners, uh, Al Capone and his gang stopped by here and uh, offered the people some money, way to make money, and offered them some printing plates of fake $10 bills, which they in turn took. And that window you see in the back there was like a wooden door that led to a um, secret room that they used to print the, uh, the fake money on. So everything went along fine for a while until uh, someone was eventually caught handing out the fake money and uh, the station never opened up again. Until, uh, and that was it, it was left abandoned. And then one time later on, they found a murder victim inside. They don't know if the person was dumped there or they were killed here. So basically that's about it. But when the, it was a gas station, it said that they had no electricity or refrigeration. They just uh, had ice and they had only cold soda when the ice man showed up. So. Um, they had no chocolate only in the winter time because it would melt with no refrigeration and they sold uh, ethyl and regular gas out here. So that's about it. We're on our way.